lashes. lashes. I like the DJ. Mr. Iconic and King I really Theory. like the DJ. Flashes, flashes, uh -oh. <laughs> What's up, guys? It's your girl, Mikhail Rose, and welcome to Rose Chronicles. I'm so excited you decided to stop by and holla at your girl. Um, today on Rose Chronicles, guys, we are going to be talking about your peeps. <laughs> I love it. Uh, your peeps. <laughs> okay, guys. So, uh, before we get into the topic of today, I have to give you the positive quote of today. Yes. Today's positive quote is, people grow on you or grow with you. Either way, they become your peeps. <laughs> they do. It's so true. Especially the ones that stick with you. All right. See, I'm already going there and y'all don't even know what I'm talking about yet. Okay. So let's talk about um, your peeps, guys. Here we go. Now, your peeps are your people. All right. Those are your people. Not your people. But them your people. Right. Um, those are your people that are they're always there and they've always been there since they got there those are your peeps right some of us may call them your crew or even fam or you know my girlfriends or my posse my homeboys you know so the thing about it is they're not always blood related these are your peoples right so you get it so you do you get it like, you, you, you kind of understand what I'm saying, right? Okay, good. Nice. Now, your peeps, they're going to come to the club with you. They're going to turn up. They're going to make sure it's lit. They're going to make sure that you make it home safe. Like, call me when you get home, or I'm going to call you when you get home, or, you know, make sure you got home, and if you don't, if you know, I'm going to come coming to find you. Those are your peeps. They also peep game and turn around and put you on to the game. Without expecting anything back. They tell you somebody talking about you, who to look out for. You know, girl, I know you introduced me to her, but when you turned around, honey, that look she gave you, honey. Uh, them your peeps. See? Yeah. And your peeps, who are who are your peeps, you gotta call them out. Call them out, right? Like, call, call out like five of your peeps right now. Now, if you don't have none, that could mean something, but don't worry, I got you. Now, when you can't call them out, um, when you can't call your peeps out from a personal relationship, um, you have to put yourself around people who fit your purpose then, okay? So what I mean by that is, if you have like family members, you know, uh, they are there, but they're not really there. Like you don't, it, feel, it feels like you don't have anybody around no friends like you know nobody that can that can look out for you the way that you look out for yourself you know almost or like you don't feel like they got your back like you feel like your peeps should have your back when you can't think of nobody that means you got to put yourself around people that fit your purpose now you know you need to know what your purpose is first before you start looking for the people right because you don't want to be looking for the people that end up, end up in the wrong purpose like <laughs> You got to think about these things, right? So, um, you want to get around people who fit your purpose, okay? And if you are around, um, if you are by yourself and you don't have anybody around, that means it's, it's almost time for the right people to come around you because you ain't got no people just like taking up space, right? So, your peeps is on the way if you can't think of none right now. I got you. See what I'm saying? And I know this because um, this is what I went through. This is also what 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 I went through. Uh, just like going into uh, going into the year 2021, you know, um, experiencing so much um, loss and lack of communications with, and lack of understandings, and just like not dealing with the bullshit in 2020. You know, by the time I got to 2021, I was like, okay, you know, uh, my circle needs to be like really different. Like, I need my peeps. Like, I need the people that have been through this hard journey with me um, that's really stuck by me. Like, you know, that really understands me and that cares. Like, they don't, they're not just yes man into everything. Like, they really say, no, sis, look, Camille, let me talk to you. 
look, the, you sh you tripping. Like, don't don't take that too personal. Like, you know, don't do that. Like, you know, go and do this instead instead of doing that because I think you fit better here, right? But they all mean well. And I'll, look, my peeps is serious, honey. I mean, I love my peeps. Like, my peeps are, 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 like, I know for a fact that if I have something going on, honey, they come in. Honey, they come in, okay? And no, they're not blood related. Ha <laughs> ha, you know? And that's always good to have your peeps that's, that's related to you because, you know, that's, that's what you call family. That's fam right there. That's fam. <laughs> so, I just, I just love, you know, having the right the right people around you and you're flourishing in your purpose, guys. There's nothing like it. It feels so, so good. Now, um, either you can help them or they can help you. Those are your peeps and peeps don't have age limits either. Like they don't, you know, doesn't that sound even better though when you think about that? It's like, man, you know, they can be older than me. Yeah. And sometimes they can be younger than you. That could be like really putting you on. Right. Um, so anybody have or has had a friend older than them who looked out for them. I'm sorry. I mean, you have. I mean, think about it. Um, now, um, whether the person was looking out for you as they got older or um, or you were looking out for somebody else as they got older and then you all became inseparable. Listen, your peeps matter. Look at celebrities whose loyal teams from the beginning, um, when they had uh, nothing at all, all the way to where they have it all. Like um, when you think of, um, who do I have here? I got like my boy LeBron James in here. Um, like his peeps, like there are peeps there uh, that are there through the thick and the thin. And they there all the way to the end. Those are your peeps, y'all. I'm trying to get you to, 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 you know, don't just say, that's my nigga, that's my bitch. No, these are your peeps, man. These are the people that will always be there for you no matter what. Give them a proper title. Thank you. Okay. Remember uh, life when Martin and Eddie Murphy, <laughs> when they were like, they were on this journey and like they had to have each other's back. You know, they had that little fuse or whatever, but they had each other's back, man. You know, that's really what it's about. Like, you know, every escape plan together, like, fail. Like, you, <laughs> it was just so hilarious. And uh, think about Martin. Remember Martin? Martin and all of his peeps to the very end. To the finale. Think about it. Look at the people who have your back at all times. Those are your peeps when you're low or even when you are high. They are your peeps. They right there with you. It feels good to have people who grow with you or who've grown on you only to stick right there with you. This is about loving those who love and support you and love everybody else from, from afar. That's okay. Okay, look. Okay, I'm going to say that one more time because some people don't be understanding that, y'all. Okay. Just because somebody um, that you love, you know, and you want to have them in the mix and it just don't flow right, hey, let them go over there. Love them from afar. It's okay. It's all right. Um, that's what you call growth, right? Because you're not allowing them to affect you or your your peeps, you or your peeps, because your peeps that really got your back, they're not going to, they're not going to feel comfortable around people who don't have your back. They're going to be like, yo, like, what's up? Like, don't call me when they hear. You know, I'm not, like, don't invite me out with them. They ain't, uh-uh, because I know that them not your peeps. That's not your real friend. That's not your people. Yep. Oh, I love it. You. Okay. So, um... Now, I know this to be true. Again, you heard me mention LeBron James and how his people, a.k.a. LeBron's peeps, who started with him are still there. They're still there. And they look out for him. Um, he's put them on. Um, they look out for him. They look out for his family. And until this very day, he does the same thing for them. He put them on because they his peeps and they still there. Oh, I love it. I think it's everything. I believe that it's life. 
it, it helps people grow and nourish and build legacies for for their friends and then their legacies for their families and then you just got like your kids and then their kids growing up together and then they know to look out for each other and they become peeps it's like huh, it's good stuff right this is what um this is what this is what happens when when you got the right people around you your children can grow with their children right and it doesn't always have to be blood related okay um my peeps are always there for me and i i gotta shout them out you know <laughs> what's up lady hey shawty shawty i love you girl uh my girl candace she's long distance but she's always there for me um and even my big cousin cynthia hey cuz i love her i mean um she's a big supporter right um and then I also have um, a few other people um, that I would love to call out their names, but um, you know I just want to keep that part uh, like you know real, 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 real straight to the point. So you get what I'm saying, right? Um, get a list of your peeps. Get a list of your peeps, guys, and cherish them. Cherish them. Make memories with your peeps for 2022. All right, get a list of things for you guys to do, right? If there's ever any um, misunderstanding, give each other space. Give each other, you know, space two to three days, maybe a week. Your peeps don't always come back to you. You know, both of y'all hot heads, y'all cool loud to be right back. What's up, girl? Hey, girl, what's up? You know, man, why were you tripping me? I don't know why were you tripping me. I'm my bad, man. Let's go get something to eat. You know. <laughs> Like, you know, um, your peeps are always there. They're always going to understand that you're both human, right? And they're not going to disown you or, disgu or disregard you because of a lack of communication, right? That's the whole point of knowing who your peeps are because they're never going to leave your side, right? And those are the type of people... For example, my boy Kevin Hart. Kevin Hart got his peeps around him, honey. Listen, 24 7, 365. He getting money, they getting money, they all getting money. <laughs> and he makes and they look out for him. Right? And he looks out for them. They had a little, they look out, you know, downfalls or fallouts every now and then. But they right back on the same show. What is it, baby? The plastic cup boys. They right, they right back up on the same. Those are his peeps. They've been there with him through his divorce they've been there through his career uh downfalls or mishaps and they're still there they acknowledge kevin put money in our pocket you know kevin my boy and they tell hey kevin man you tripping me you like like fall back you know like those are the people that you want around you i'm still trying to see where the hell is will smith peeps because we will need some Will need some peeps in his corner <laughs> to, to just like walk up on, on Jay's set and just flip over the red table and just be like, that's my boy Will. And just walk the hell off. Like, <laughs> I'm serious. I have to be controversial on this one because I'm so serious. Um, my heart goes out to Will Smith, his whole, his whole family. I just hope that, 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 you know, they just get it together, honey. I love y'all, but still, like, please. Will need some peeps. We'll need some peeps. I'm just saying. Now, the holidays are almost here. So, as I said before, guys, um, get with your peeps. Make plans to do stuff. Like, now things are slowly opening back up. Spend time with your peeps. Do new stuff with your peeps. Take pictures with your peeps. The holidays are coming. Like, hey, Thanksgiving, Friendsgiving, yes. 2022 is coming, guys. Get with your peeps. Make plans for next year, even if it's one or two uh, trips or one or two big get-togethers. You can just get all your all the people that you genuinely love and that loves you equally, right? Spend some time with all those people. It's necessary and it's good and it feels so amazing. I'm definitely gonna be planning something, right, baby? We're going to plan something. Yep, he's shaking his head. Okay. 
awesome. So um, I'm going to start planning soon. <laughs> so that's what I'm talking about, y'all. You know, I just, I just feel like I wanted to do this to get everybody pumped up and ready for the holidays and also get them ready for 2022 because it's going to be so good. And you want to have the right people around you. And even if you don't have people that you can call your, you can call your peeps right now, even if you don't have them, just know that they're coming. Getting to go out, like if you're into fashion, right? And <clears throat> excuse me, if you're into fashion and you don't have no peeps because you feel like it's like nobody out there is going to like me, no, go to some fashion shows. Network with some people, right? Network with uh, people who have the same interest as you, right? Try something different. Go do some yoga. Yoga and fashion. I don't know. Find, find, find your peeps because they are out there. They, they, they're out there, guys, right? And if you're a man... And, and your peep happen to be uh your peeps happen to be a lot of women. Make sure that your wife uh or your girlfriend is cool with all your peeps. You can't have peeps the opposite sex and be like, oh, but they don't like her and she don't like them. That ain't gonna work. Downfall. Okay. It doesn't work like that. So I just want to throw that out there just for all y'all to be like, man, but she be tripping. Well, you need to make sure that your peeps and, and her get along or something. Like, you the man in the middle. I know that's all off the subject, but I just wanted to throw that out there. So make sure everybody get along with your peeps. Make sure your peeps get along with everybody else too, but they got your back, okay? Um, I think that that is what uh, is most important, guys, is preparing for the holidays, preparing with your peeps like making plans for 2022 um as you're you know building your business or as you're working a job or whatever it is where you are you when you let your hair down with the right group of people you're always in the position to give back to work happy um to love people more to give people what what what's needed of 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 you to give to them and that's the whole point guys you want to have your peeps around it's going to help build you up you build them up and at the end of the day guys um it's all love because it's your peeps it's your peeps <laughs> so i love you guys remember 2022 is coming so y'all get ready because it's going to be an amazing year um with that being said guys it is your girl michael rose i love you smooches and roses is it? We sing it. We all.